Hey guys, Guild here with a quick video on some basic functions of Immersive Equipment Display, or IED. Before we get too far into it, make sure you remember this is not a full walkthrough and it's just a quick video for a simple basic function. Today we're mainly going to focus on shifting your one-handed swords to your back for that classic Geralt of Rivia look. First things first, open up your IED menu with the backspace key. On the left we have the display manager which handles what items show up and on the right is the gear positioning which handles where they are placed on the character skeleton. There are a few tabs at the top called global actor, NPC, and race. These handle the nodes for either all NPCs or just a specific actor. Make sure you have unrestricted placement turned on then select the weapon and choose the placement after setting the placement in IED, as I have the XPMSE skeleton, I then need to go into the MCM and make sure the animation is proper for where the weapon is now located. And there you have it. You can now see we have our one-handed sword alongside our two-handed one, right on the back, ready to be used. Keep in mind, as always, the best way to learn is to try out new options in the menu and reset them to the default if the desired effect is not what you'd like. Make sure to check out the IED pages on Nexus for more information as well as custom presets for others. After this video section is a brief clip on how to change the secondary sword to also be on the back. <laughs> 